Maceration Techniques to Study the Element of Xylem and Phloem Part Slight Preparation Using the Squash Method Take the macerated stem, wash it in a water, transfer the material into clean glass slide. Using a tweezer and razor blade, split the stem. And put the stain. Leave it for 50 to 60 seconds and squash it. Now remove the excess of stain using water and blotting paper. Now add few drops of water and place the cover slip. Avoid air bubbling. Carefully place the cover slip and tap it with the blunt end or rubber end pencil or pipette. This squashes the material and separates the tissues. Now your slide is ready for the observation. Slide preparation using tease mount techniques. These techniques are usually used for the woody material where take the macerated wood sample that is here we taken the garlic flower stalk and wash it in a water. Transfer the material into clean glass slide. Split open the material using a tweezer and a razor blade.
before we are going to observe the material what we have prepared let's find out what we need to observe under the microscope xylem element xylem element consists of four types of cells one is called as tracheids another one is vessel xylem parenchyma and the fiber tracheids are generally spindle shaped elongated and have tapered end whereas vessels are made up of vessel element which are narrow hollow and elongated and sometimes short just joined together by large perforated plates whereas xylem parenchyma are the only metabolically active cells in the xylem element and xylem fiber they provide the structural support to the plant tracheid and vessel element are dead at maturity but of course they are alive during their development process they have very elaborated and taxonomically distinctive cell wall patterns these includes annular spiral scalary form reticulated and simple and bold here you can see the different types of wall pattern in the xylem element the vessel and the tracheid element annular spiral scalary form reticulated and the pitted let me observe the slide under the microscope annular thickening this thickening occurs in the forms of ring like patterns this is the tracheid element of cucurbita stem spiral thickening this thickening occurs in the form of spiral this is the garlic outer peel macerated material which are stained you can observe the tracheid element how it is connected with each other you can also observe the tapering end and it is spiral thickening this is the vessel element of uh, garlic flower stalk macerated materials here you can observe the thickenings which is occur in the form of network this is called the reticulate thickening here comes once again our garlic outer peel macerated slide where you can see the tracheid element with the reticulate pattern This is the scalary form vessel element of garlic flower stalk. 
here the thickening occurs in the form of ladder like appearance therefore it's called as scalary form This is the macerated wood material. Here you can see the tracheids. The lignin deposition on the tracheary wall is uniform but interrupted by pits. Pitted tracheids and vessels may have simple pits that is without border. or pits that are surrounded by a thickened rim of wall material that is border pits here you are seeing a simple pits This is the tracheids of pinus fruit. Here you can observe a wall pattern called as border pits, a pit pair in which the pit chamber is over arched by the cell wall, creating a larger pit chamber and a smaller pit aperture. 